Oh, hey, what's up, man? Yeah, you want to play tennis? Yeah, yeah, give me, give me 10 seconds. Let me grab my racket real quick. Yeah, hon, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, it's absolute beast. Huh? Yeah. Look at this thing. It's a racket! Look at this. Foie gras in a can. Who knew? It's like next thing you know, you're out in the boat, you're enjoying a beautiful sunny day with your buds, you got your white claws, your trulies, you bring your foie gras with you on the boat, and you're not looking and you reach, and you're like, oh, you know, I'm thirsty, I'm parched, I want some, uh, some white claw. Next thing you know, you're, you're putting some uh, foie gras duck liver down your gullet. <laughs> Could be good. Could be terrible. I know you're looking at that title and saying to yourself, what's going on here? But listen, stick with me. I love hot cuisine. I love fine dining. I love complex flavors and exotic ingredients from all over the world. But you know what? We all have guilty pleasures and this is mine. This week, we're going zero to 100 in 0.07 seconds. We're gonna be making a grilled cheese, peanut butter and jam sandwich. It's essentially a charcuterie board grilled cheese if you wanna call it that. It's got your bread, it's got your nuts, it's got your jam, it's got your, your cheese, it's got it all. And I promise it's delicious. It is fantastic. You can't make up your mind between a grilled cheese sandwich and a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Put them together, it sounds crazy, I promise, but it is decadent. You're gonna love it, so let's go. Come on, let's go. The time has come, my friends. Listen to that. Crispy, buttery, 